Yo there guys, what is up, Luke Games here, and today, I have some news for you guys, 1.3 is literally a sniff away now, this is the final push to 1.3. Point three. Now, Pyworks released some new news on the Terraria forums. You may have saw it already. It was covered on Monday, so this is already out by now. And they named it the Final Push. Now, they do go on to explain a bit in this post that it's pretty much the same as before. They're still figuring out all the bugs. They're still working out all the bugs. And their statement pretty much remains the same. The game is still being worked on. There is almost an estimate date. Almost. They want to be more transparent with us and share more with us. So at this time, there is only a little over 30 bugs remaining to fix. And you don't understand how excited that makes me feel. 30 bugs isn't that many. Within those bugs, though, they don't have to find out what causes them. And, you know, they have to go through, fix coding, and figure out what parts of the game they're actually affecting. So once they've done that, they will be able to optimize the game better. The issues that they're actually tackling at the minute are remaining piece of the optimization, online gameplay, multiplayer, all that sort of stuff. There is localization bugs, which I assume, again, is probably split screen and uh, local things, maybe opening inventories, trashing things. We don't know. It could be anything like that. A few stability slash functionality bugs. That could be anything from a tree being in a building, a boss not working as it should do, or things like that, and things what might cause glitches later on in the game. And there is just general feedback back going around with Relogic and 505 games. They go on to say that it isn't a simple port, but it's a complete rewrite of the future Terraria. We'll be getting all the new updates faster. We'll be able to get all the current updates a lot faster now. And Pyworks really wanted to take this in and make it the best they could. So I really appreciate the work they've done and everything they've been working on this. In the background, I do have some 1.3 gameplay for treasure bags. As you see in the background, it's working really well. I think the weapons are working quite fine. The game is almost there. And again, just stability bugs and things like that. And only 30 of them holding us back so far. So we should be there soon. One really interesting thing is you use LT or L2 on a PS4 as they're shown in the background on a PS4. That is what you do to open a treasure bag. So I'm really excited about that. And it looks really well optimized so far. But this update is going to be well worth the wait, guys. I know it's still like 50 million years. And they have actually mentioned that it's taking a lot longer than their original estimate. But again, they want to be more transparent with us. They want to tell us exactly what's being worked on. And again, be part of a community. As I said in my last video, they want to be there for us. They want to be there to help us out. They want to be there to share what they're going through at the minute so that we can have sort of an idea in our heads of when it's out. Now, you might be asking me, Luke, you, you've just told me all this. What's the point? You've not told me a date. Well, we don't have a date just yet, but these bugs, there's like just over 30 bugs there. I can't imagine that will take too long, but again, they've got to crack down on this. It's all been rewritten, as I say, to work with future updates and potentially even cross-platform. Now that is pretty much it for the 1.3 update. That is everything we know. Chippy Gaming did cover this a few days ago as well. So if you want to go check his out, his explanation, go over there. He explains things really well. So go drop him a sub. Now, one other thing that I did really want to show you guys is that Xbox 360, PS3, PS Vita, and Wii U will no longer receive updates. I will leave this page in the description. As I said in my previous video, these consoles are not getting any more updates updates. Same with 3DS as well. 3DS is on there, but it's actually regarding the Wii U and 3DS together. And that's for people who keep constantly asking me, is it coming out on 360? Is it coming out on PS3? Is it coming out on Wii U? Here we go. Here is the definitive list. What is not coming out for no PS Vita, no PS3, no Xbox 360, no Wii U, and of course, no 3DS. Now, the last thing I want to touch on is mobile and Nintendo Switch. Pyworks have already said, and I've mentioned this in previous videos, that the mobile edition and the Nintendo Switch edition will be out after consoles. Now, these are currently in the works, but they're being worked on alongside. I think that'll take a little bit longer. With that, will bring us bigger and better things. Of course, the release on Nintendo Switch will be absolutely amazing, and the release on mobiles will be awesome. They've got to optimize it a lot more for mobiles, I guess. And it's a lot of work, a lot of coding, and a lot of time that is being put into this. So what we can do in the meantime is go over to Pipeworks, support their streams, support their tweets, support everything they have, and work alongside them. Let's bring the biggest and best update we could ever have. I just want to personally thank you guys for being so awesome and waiting this long. Developers putting in a great job. They really are. And it is really going to be worth the wait, in my opinion. Again, you can think what you want, but this update has got me very, very hyped. When I saw this news on Monday, I was so, so happy 
And, you know, I, I just can't wait for it. But anyway, guys, I'm super hyped for it. Hopefully you are too. I'll see you next time. If you do want to check out any 1.3 news, I've covered loads of videos on it. I think I've done about nine now. <laughs> it's getting it's getting to that point where I've done so many videos. But this is new news. This is fresh news. And hopefully it's brought a bit of hope into the game for you guys. But guys, I'll see you next time. Please don't subscribe. Stay frosty. And peace.